started the season and we weren't really sure what was going to happen. Um, we were hoping for the best, thought of as many different things that we could plan to do as possible, knowing that some things might fall by the wayside. We started with the Nutcracker. It was something that we had planned to do prior to COVID and weren't sure if we were even going to be able to do it this year, but our students were hungry for a performance opportunity. So normally we do an acting show in January and we've previously done it at the Overture Center. Unfortunately, that was not gonna work out this year with the Overture being closed. So what we ended up doing was a staged reading through our online platform where all the students were in their bedrooms at home doing their character and reading their lines. And then we created a video showcase of them doing their reading. By this point, we, we had done a video, we had done a, a virtual stage reading. We were wanting to have that energy from the audience. So the only way that we could do that was have an outside performance. My father and I built a stage in our parking lot and our nine company dancers got to dance outside on a beautiful spring day and show their family and friends all their hard work throughout the season. Then we got to our big spring show. Instead of Saturday in the park, it was Saturday in the park, in a barn on a Sunday. It was very rustic, but very beautiful, and just a great, great opportunity for us all to come together for these kids and let them showcase their hard work. What a great year we had. I cannot thank you all enough. The students, the staff, the family, the friends, everybody, everyone came together this year to make this possible and let the students have this year as not a year of pause, but a year that they could continue to grow and continue doing what they love to do.